Families in the district were given the choice to pursue either in-person learning or to continue remote. They'll receive another survey next week, asking them to make that choice again. Another group of students will return on October 12th. As more students return, district officials say monitoring them has to ramp up. The Fabens Middle School principal says about 30% of her students are now back on campus. She says someone is assigned to each hall to ensure that students keep their masks on and adhere to social distancing guidelines. One of the challenges, especially with students that age, is allowing them to socialize while staying safe. The superintendent tells us the district is even considering technology to help. We're going to have to look for some ways where they can socialize. Right now, I think that we're talking about how can we use the Chromebooks, the devices that they have so that they can socialize. We don't want them to come back into the building and not have an opportunity to talk to their friends. That's the whole point for them, especially in middle school. The superintendent tells us the district is still working to better connect the students who are working remote with those who are learning in person. She says the district is also continuing to distribute more Chromebooks as well. Madeline Otterley, ABC7.